Dear Lloyd, first I'd like to thank you for your work on testing all of the masks. They are very informative, very helpful, and there's so many brands on the market. Sent to you is the BYD, oh I know BYD, KN95 masks to get tested. FYI, I got them from an online grocery store. We. Oui. All right, so these are the BYD. BYD is one of the largest mask manufacturers in the world. Daddy, they can open both of these? We're going to open in a minute. Just settle down. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Um, we're, uh, uh, they, they actually, they were making, they make cars, electric cars, this company, like Tesla. They're like the huh. Tesla of China. And they decided that they're going to pivot to making masks because people need masks. And now they can make supposedly 50 million masks a day. That is a lot of masks. Why do people make so much masks? I don't know. I'd love to know. Uh, this is one of them. They're KN95. There's too many. And you can pack. see this is like back to like uh, whoever was asking before. This is a legitimate KN95 because you've got the manufacturer name. You've got GB2626-2006. So they didn't even have to put this on there, but they did. They've got KN95. Good job, Joy. I don't know why. Anyway. This is a little bit different than um, the way that uh, NIOSH would do it. This is the machine. This is the TSI uh, 83 or 8130A. Is the machine that NIOSH uses in their lab to test can. Actually, I think they use the 8130, which is the older version, but this one's got a little prettier readout. And uh, yes, thank you, Julie. And uh, the, the difference is uh, they're actually using beeswax to seal it and we're using a 3D printed thing. But TSI does not have a recommended method for doing this part of it, which I would say for a $100,000 machine, it's very annoying. Well, very annoying. Like, just tell us. We have 30 seconds left on the test. We have 30 seconds left. We're getting, um, t this is, looks like a good test. We're getting 111 Pascals. That's pretty good. Hope there's no more. Oh, and what does it say? Look at that, 98.41%, 98.41%, 112.4 Pascals. That's really good. That's really good. 98%, that's a great mask. Not surprised, they're one of the biggest mask manufacturers in the world. I'd probably trust them. Let's go ahead and, I'm gonna do the test here and do that. This is the broken mask, but I wanna keep one. Uh, yeah, there's definitely a cut. Mm. This smells like uh, polypropylene shower. Wait, let me smell it. You want to smell it? <laughs> she wants to smell it. It smells like you. Okay. That makes sense. Um, like well, let's do the ear loop test. Do the ear loop test. Try to pull the ear loops off. Try to break them. Okay. Try. Pretty good, huh? Oh! What do you think? Were those pretty good? Yeah, it kind of hurt. It kind of hurt. <laughs> Yeah, those are pretty good. 